Well, g'day everybody and welcome back to Fishing North Atlantic for episode number two. All right, so I've heard a lot of people have been having a lot of bugs and a lot of problems with this game, but uh, so far we've been okay. So um, let's have a look. I just want to dock here. Okay, maybe holding E won't allow me to dock. There we go. That's a little bit better. Uh, because what I thought we might do is we might go into uh, rigging and uh, we might set ourselves up for this, uh, for rigging for deep line fishing because I wouldn't mind um, trying out, I want to I want to move towards doing some lobster and stuff like that because we haven't uh, we haven't done any of that at this, um, you, know, you know I mean that's all new and stuff so I thought what we could do is, uh, is just uh, work towards doing that so rather than going out with a harpoon uh, and spending hours out there trying to harpoon and find fish I thought we could uh, we could do some deep line fishing. So what we need to do now is we need to buy some of these. So I'm thinking maybe four of them. Um, I'm not sure how many because we haven't upgraded our hull yet. So uh, maybe we could do four and see how four go. Uh, if we go back now, bait deep lines. Oh, I'd only purchased three. I don't know why. Uh, so let's uh, uh, bait that. Let's do one of those and bait that, and do another one of those and bait that. Uh, we've got enough to to purchase another. Uh, you currently have four out of a maximum of eight. Okay, no worries, that's fine. Uh, so this one is unbaited. So uh, we've got herring, squid, herring. So we'll do this in squid, and we will bait that as well you can uh, you can get a refund you can get a refund for your bait all right so we'll do that and I thought uh, what have we got left 7263 what does the next storage upgrade cost us uh, there's one there for uh, 5,000 so maybe we can do that gives us an extra 1,000 so we'll check out uh, that will be as far as we can possibly go now. So what I thought we might be able to do, uh, deep deep line fishing requires crew to haul the line. Are you sure to leave? Okay, I might have just got ourselves into a little bit of trouble there. Uh, let's go back, let's go into town and have a look at what a crew member is going to cost us because I've just spent all of our money. Uh, the cheapest crew member that we can get is 15000 by the looks of it. Hmm, that's going to uh, that's going to be a bit of a problem, isn't it? That's going to be quite the problem because I don't think we can borrow. Uh, we can borrow ten thousand, uh, take out loan, and take out loan. So we'll get two of those. <laughs> wow, I didn't think that through, did I? But you guys know me. I never think those things through. So now we've got uh, 22,000, so we can probably get ourselves a just a cheap crew member, somebody that can, uh, let's see, we're going deep line, so we'll see if we can find a cheap member that does decent deep line. That's four. Uh, he is three. Um, he is only two. Uh, he's three as well, and he is... So I think Pearl would be the best one at uh, at four. So uh, twenty two thousand one hundred. It's not going to leave us with much money, but hey, you know we're in it to make profit. So all right, lovely. Let's uh let's head out of uh, head out of port here now. Yeah. So a lot of people have been saying that they're having lots of problems and, and encountering lots and lots of bugs with this. We have our autopilot up top there as well, which is actually pretty awesome. And that's going to come in handy for uh, for long line fishing, I think, or for deep line fishing, I think, uh, as well as uh, as well as probably long line and stuff like that. But I'm not overly sure whether at this point in time I want to get into long line because we were doing that in fishing barren sea so i thought maybe we could do something just a little bit different this time and sort of head in a bit of a different direction so uh, more towards lobster maybe crab and stuff like that so that would be really really nice we are heading out at 100 miles an hour 
Uh, full throttle, basically. Look at that big ship. So, apparently, in this, um, apparently, um, the AI ships actually do fish, and uh, the amount of fishing that they do also um, also dictates fish prices, which is pretty cool. Uh, I actually really like that mechanic, so. Uh, so I was thinking maybe we go into, um, uh, we'll keep doing swordfish and tuna for a little while and then get into lobster and snow crab, so. Uh, I thought we could do that. Now, also, I'd just like to thank the developers for actually sending me a key for this. Um, I There we go. We'll come, we'll come out here and have a look at what's going on out here. Um, I actually purchased this game um, and probably uh, like 10 minutes after I filmed the first episode, um, the devs actually sent me a key. So, um, oh, look at that over there. There we go. Look at that. Let's have a look at what that is. Uh, oh, that's day. Oh, oh no. Yeah, no, 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 no. Oh, get out of the. Don't keep going. Don't keep going forward, you idiot. Um. Yeah. So. At least in fishing Barrett C, they uh they seem to stop. Look, he's just honking us. He's just honking us. Let's get out of his way. Um, yeah, so so anyway, um, oh, I can't even remember what I was saying before he did that. So yeah, anyway, um, 10 minutes after I recorded the first episode of this, um, the devs actually uh, contacted me with a key. So uh, I, did, I did manage to get to refund it from Steam and uh, I am using the key that the developers did provide me with. So so big thank you to the developers for that. Um, I got a little bit excited and wanted to get an episode out as quickly as I could um, with you guys and kind of didn't really wait as long as I probably should have. So, um, so that was awesome. Thank you very much to the devs. Let's uh, head out to this question mark. You were entering shallow water. Tell me about it. Um, it's a little bit better than, uh, than a life of being in deep water, isn't it? Um, so yeah, anyway, that's all cool. I'm just going to head over here and see what this, uh, what this question mark is over here. There we go. Now we did do some, uh, upgrades and stuff on our, um, on our boat. So we did upgrade, um, radars and and whatnot as well so uh, let's see what we've got up here it's pretty cool now that we've got the autopilot in that it adds the autopilot to the uh it hangs it up there that's pretty cool i actually really like that ah we found the borg it's now available for us to purchase that is pretty cool you'll remember from uh fishing baron sea that's the first boat that you um that you start off with that's pretty cool Oh, I do do love the whole do love the whole uh ocean. I think they've I think they've made it they've made it feel so much better. And the devs had have said that uh, and it's actually in the wiki as well if you read the wiki. Um the devs have said that you know what they've done is is they've taken um they've taken all of those suggestions and all of those wants that players wanted from fishing Barrent Sea and tried to add them in here. So um, and you know they, they they seem to have done that. I mean the whole idea of being able to anchor your boat now um, outside uh, out, out in the uh, out in the open water there um, and wait for your lines is just so much better than having to travel back uh, to port every single time. So I do like that. I do like it very much. So you've got in uh, the wiki there where you can see here where it says fishing barren sea. Um, Fishing North Atlantic is based on our previous game, Fishing Baron C, which was our first PC game released 7th of February 2018. Uh, it's also available on PlayStation. Yeah, but, 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 but. Uh, since Fishing Baron C became such a, such a success, we've carefully, carefully been listening to our community's feedback and suggestions and decided to rebuild, overhaul, and improve most of the major features from Fishing Baron C. We have more, uh, more or less started from scratch. So, uh, that is actually pretty cool. I, I actually think that that's magnificent. 
So, the, you know, they've listened to a lot of what the, commu- the community uh, want and um, and they've worked towards providing that for us. So, yeah, so apparently all these boats that are out here fishing, they're not out there just for good looks and uh, just for a little bit of... Um, a little bit of interaction and stuff they are actually out there because um can we uh yes we can there's the sonar um they're actually out there now for uh they've actually changed things around to 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 make it um uh, so that those boats are actually fishing and are actually pulling fish out of the water and selling them at the market so that is pretty awesome to be honest what we're going to do is uh, we're going to hoot around uh, with this radar going and see what we can find uh, and see if we can find a location that has uh, that has some uh, decent fish and stuff so and just uh, have a look at that on the uh, <laughs> in the binoculars there there we go so uh, so what we're kind of doing is we're probably more looking for uh, oh you yeah, see that probably would have been all right I don't want to go too fast. Uh, I do want to find a decent. I do want to find a decent place to um, to to drop these. So, uh, one of the things that um, that I did find when I was having a bit of a fiddle with it uh, outside of recording was that um, what's that fish? Don't know. Don't know what that is. Um, outside of recording, it was, um, you know, in regards to spear fishing and stuff like that, it was a bit of a, uh, a bit of a pain in the butt, to be honest. Uh, trying to find any fish, any swordfish or anything on the surface. So, all right. So we'll just uh, keep cruising along here. We'll see what kind of uh, what kind of fish we can find on the sonar. Where's the sonar? Right there that'll help us a little bit 100 meters we'll find a nice little location that we can start dropping these and then we're going to try and set up the autopilot and see how the autopilot goes because we do need to be out here as well I know it says that you need a crew member what's that but like uh, hmm I'm not sure. So I know it says you need a crew member, but uh, I think uh, from what I was from what I was reading and what I've been hearing, um, the crew members are, are a little uh, are a little bugged when it comes to uh, putting these uh, deep lines out. However, what we will do is we will go into crew and we will grab her and have her preparing gear and see how she goes. Uh, we will also go in here and we shall turn on uh, turn on the work lights. And we shall, what's that one there, uh, switch on. No, we don't really need interior lights or search lights, to be honest. So we'll, uh, we'll, we'll keep our eye out here and we'll keep our eye out on the sonar and we'll get her to start dropping now. So, so what we're going to do is I'm going to stop the boat and it is really actually quite difficult to, uh, to control the speed of the boat and stuff, but they are bringing in, um, um, uh, provision for using a steering wheel and a throttle which would actually be quite good so let's uh let's see let's increase the autopilot uh, let's turn the autopilot on how do we turn that on uh can we turn that on how do we turn it on toggle autopilot doesn't seem to be working for me I'm hitting E and holding E and it's not working and toggling and it's not working uh, increase autopilot speed well I hope that wasn't a waste of money that we just spent there um, alright let's see oh we can drop anchor from here uh, use horn yes sorry about that guys I just had to do that uh, all right so let me see that is not working can we do that from out here or not I don't think with I don't think that we can don't think that we can do it out from out here we can adjust all of our lights and all that type of stuff uh, look at what's in storage etc 
but I don't think we can. I don't think our autopilot is working at all, uh, at all because I can't even. I'm, I'm I'm clicking it to toggle it, uh, and then I'm also clicking and holding, but it doesn't seem to want to work for me. So that's a bit of a problem. That was a bit of a waste of money, wasn't it? Increase speed. No. 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 No, no, okay. All right, that's not going to help us at all. That's not going to help us at all. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put that on. I'm going to get out of here. And we are going to go and uh, go and set these lines. There we go. So hopefully she'll, yep, she's prepared those for us. Uh, I think we have to wait until, um, I think we have to wait until uh, we can... Um, until we're about 100 meters away to deploy the next one, yeah, 100 meters there you go I wonder whether I can get a uh, I wonder whether I can get in here and have her uh, control this, okay, yeah, yep, okay, no worries, that's fine uh, so she's prepared it um, can't have her deploy it so we have to deploy it ourselves. Okay. Let's just jump out of here and we'll deploy the next one or otherwise we're gonna be in strife, aren't we? There we go. Uh, there we go, jump back in there, jump in there. I'd just like to, yeah, we, we, we know that because we turned the hut off ourselves. Look at that. What a lovely shot that is. I'm gonna just take a shot of that. There we go, beautiful. Just one more for prosperity. Back in here again. Uh, let's get out of here. Hopefully she's prepared that, so that's four. There we go, beautiful. All right, lovely. So what we will do is... Um, okay, that stopped the boat. When I clicked autopilot and toggled the autopilot, that actually stopped the boat. So if I click that, it stops the boat. Am I missing something? I may be missing something, might I? Alright, so what we'll do is uh, we will spin around. We'll spin around, we'll wait, uh, we'll, 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 uh, we can anchor out here and wait for some, uh, there's another fishing boat out there. Is he heading towards our, our lines, our deep lines? He may be, by the looks of it. It looks like he's heading this way. So we'll spin around here. Uh, then we will wait for, um, I'm not sure how long you put the, uh, put the deep lines down. I will learn how long you leave them down for, but, um, I think we'll probably leave them down for about 18 hours or something like that. Maybe um, we might we might uh, anchor for uh, say yeah. I think we might anchor for 18 hours and uh, and see what happens. Now what happens with these uh, with these long line uh, these deep lines is that they've got a second buoy on them. A buoy, sorry, sorry, goofy. Uh, a second buoy on them and. Um, and basically what happens is when that line has uh, has caught a fish, that second buoy actually floats to the surface. So I don't know how they rigged them. I'm not sure how they rigged them, but uh, that is actually pretty cool, to be honest. So, so we'll see what we can get out here. Uh, we might as well, crew-wise, uh, we might as well put her back in resting, so... She can rest. Uh, there's no point in her actually even being out on the uh, out on the deck at all. So, so we'll spin around here. Our uh, first buoy's over there. So, if we just line ourselves up, there we go. Um, if you guys know, if you guys know what I'm doing wrong with the uh, with the the whole autopilot, then let me know. Or uh, if you're also having trouble with it, let me know as well. So, because it'd be interesting to know if I was doing something wrong. Okay, there you go. So what we can do now is uh, we can 
We can set our anchor. I think it was out here, wasn't it? Is it out here we set anchor? Yeah, anchor. Uh, and we will wait for... Let's wait for 18 hours and uh, see what happens. Okay, so if we hit the map now... Okay, so we're on blue. And that one is uh, on red, and that one is on blue, and that one is on red. So maybe, maybe we should... Um, Let's have a look. Uh, come on, I want to. I want to head in that direction. There we go. All right. Yep, I know that. Okay. So what you can see there is that uh, that buoy has popped the second one. So basically, that means that line has. Um, yeah, I think the other one just popped as well. So those lines have fish on them now. So what we can do now, we know that uh, we know that there's fish have taken the bait. Uh, we can actually jump in here. Let's uh, get her back out on and get her ready to uh, haul. And we will go out here. Oh, it's lovely, isn't it? It, it looks magnificent. I, I do like it. Let's uh, move towards here. And what we should see... Actually, I wonder whether from out here we can just hit set deep line when we're actually setting them I'm not sure so look this is all experimental for me guys I'm just working it out as I go there we go okay so uh, we need to haul this here we go oh missed there we go perfect ah oh, you've actually got to move back okay lovely now uh, that was good I do enjoy the mini games that they put on here. She's a little bit delayed, isn't she? Uh, have we got four fish on here, or is this the last one? Perfect. There you go. Okay, so there was three on that line. Okay, lovely. All right, let's move into the next one. What did we get? Uh, 791 kilos. That's probably not much. So what I might do... Um dismiss that deep line bite so there's alerts there's there's alerts telling us what's going on what I might do now is um come on there you go is uh, I might I might wait for another couple of hours and see what happens just uh, just testing at the moment guys just testing to see what happens so uh, let's wait another we waited 18 hours so let's let's wait another two hours let's see what's happened here now uh, let's move forward deep line bite there we go so uh, that was another alert so it's been uh, it's been bitten again so so we might pull this one in and see what we get kilo wise on this one There we go, haul in the deep line. <clears throat> Excuse me, guys. Uh, have we got... Perfect. There. Oh, swordfish. Lovely. Beautiful. Another perfect. Wow. <laughs> Big fish. And that one was just good. Okay, so we only had three fish on there still. Uh, 489 kilos. That's not much at all, is it? Um, all right, which means... What we might need to do is... Uh, let's see. So, so they've been out now for... I'm just trying to sort of suss it out because some people say 18 hours. Some people say 24 hours. Others say between 20 and 24 hours, so I don't know. I don't know. It's all it's all conjecture. It's all conjecture, but uh, let's see what we can do. Let's go another two hours. There we go. Oh, look at that. Isn't that magnificent? I do, I do have to take a screenshot of that. Sorry, guys. There we go. <laughs> that is beautiful. 
All right, let's jump in here. So, uh, yeah, everybody's an expert. Everybody's an expert. Um, let's see what we've got here. Let's get ready to haul these ones in. I probably should have had her. Uh, I don't know what her energy is like at the moment. Uh, don't know. Can't see. Can't see. So here we go. Let's haul this one in as well. This is actually I'm I, I'm enjoying this. I enjoy I'm enjoying this more than I enjoyed long line fishing. So there we go, haul you in. What have we got there? We've got three fish there. Uh, that was good, so that's not very good. We want perfect, don't we really? Uh, that's good. That's only good as well. Uh, I will get better at it. I will get better at it. Let's uh, bring that in. Wow, he's swishing around, isn't he? That was perfect, that one. Okay, so what did we get here? I would have expected around a thousand kilos per line. Um, okay, so let's dismiss that. Let's get out now. And we will try that had more that had more on it than what we have got yet so uh, let's close that let's now wait for two hours there we go click OK go back in here and now we will see what's going on with this next one and what we get on this next one the line is still actually blue so it'll be interesting to see but it, uh, it's definitely gone off, obviously. There we go. Ah, another night of fishing. Another night of fishing. What's that uh, green flash over there? You see what would be causing that green flash? Apparently you do, do you do see the aurora here as well, so occasionally, just not just not every night, which is uh, probably to be expected. Okay, here we go and haul you in. Okay, what do we got down here? Perfect, excellent. That's what I want. I want perfects. Okay. Uh, that one. That one was just inevitably crap. Uh, right from the moment I decided in my head that I was going to press that button. Calm down. Uh, that one's only good as well. Ah, there's a swordfish on that one. So what did we get kilo-wise there? 829, okay. Alright, dismiss that. Uh, let's put her into resting. And uh, let's hit that. Go inside the cab be great to be able to get that working wouldn't it nope there we go it just turns the boat off completely uh, there's no other triggers there's no other triggers okay no other triggers at all nope okay all right, so what we're going to do now is we might head into... We haven't unlocked this port here, so we might head into this port here and see what we've got here. There we go. Let's, uh, let's fast travel there. Not sure how long it'll take us to get there. Probably a couple of hours or something, I think. Okay, let's return. pull ourselves in here let's uh, shut those off uh, actually we're going to need the work lights on anyway uh, well, the running lights have to stay on we're going to need the work lights on because we're going to have to unload in a sec by the looks of it be nice if you could actually dock from in here but I don't think you can I think you've still got to go outside to dock yeah all right, would you like to sell your fish at Dennis Point? Let's see what we got for this. Let's go yes. Only 52,000. Hmm. Uh, tuna 
usually sells for twenty dollars a kilo. What? Um. Wow, that's like twelve dollars under. Do you think we should just sell this? Because uh, that usually sells for twenty-five, and it's selling for uh, twenty-six at the moment. Let's sell that. Uh, let's rebate our lines while we are here. Uh, let's see, f uh, fishing gear, uh, bait deep lines, um, bait with that, bait with that. I'll just I'll just alternate them, and bait with that. Okay, beautiful. Because what we're going to do, what I want to do, is uh, I just want to head out of here and uh, maybe go and deploy these again and head into the other port that we that we um, already started at and just see what price I can get. Because that was like that was like twelve dollars less than what the average price for tuna is. So. Um, I don't think there's any point in selling that here for eight dollars a kilo um, I'm not sure how long before the fish decay and stuff like that. Let's have a look out here uh, So we're going to head up to here Which means we might go and see what we can find out there. Maybe uh, Let's in there 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 and there uh, A day ago swordfish over here. All right, let's head there so we'll uh, fast travel out here. Are we going to hit a boat? No, nope, we managed to miss it. Beautiful. So we'll head over here. A day ago, swordfish was spotted out here. I don't know where that information came from. Uh, let's get her ready for. Um, let's get her ready for uh, for prepping. She can prepare the gear. Lovely. Right, let's uh, move forward at a rapid pace and she can deploy now can she deploy is she gonna deploy is that deploy or is that oh no just that's just prep gear okay there you go that's okay all right, let's keep moving. Let's keep moving. Can't see anything out here. It's quite nice how dark it is, isn't it? So, uh, yep, no worries. We got that. We we know we just did that. You don't really need to remind us that we just did that because we actually know. Alert set to yeah. I know. I know. I, I just pressed the button. I just held my mouse button down to do that. So, all right, should go uh, white. There we go, we can throw that one out as well. Yes, yes, yes. I wish they'd get rid of that crap. That is so annoying. Um, Alright, so here we go. Uh, so we're going to go 24 hours. So what we'll do is uh, we'll set this one as well. There we go. Beautiful. We'll go into the... Uh, no, we won't go into the map yet. What we will do is go into there and uh, put her back on resting and now we will go into the map and we will travel over here through here through there hopefully we don't come face to face with anybody and actually have our boat hit again oh there's a there's a question mark there we do need to we're gonna have to remember that now what is it uh, let's have a look at how long they've been out for it's one and a half hours out there, guys. Have a look at how beautiful that looks. <gasps> Isn't that magnificent? That is... I have so many uh, screenshot choices there. Seriously. Oh, yeah. Just absolutely love it. Love it. All right. I think it, I think it is. I think it's uh, a, a lot more beautiful than what... Uh, than what Fishing Barren Sea was. A lot more beautiful. Okay, so let's let's hope let's hope that uh, they're, they're buying tuna for a, a lot better a price than uh, than eight dollars a kilo. Let's hope they're they're buying them closer to uh, closer to the uh, twenty dollars a kilo that it averages at. All right, so it's still a little bit low, but definitely a lot better. That's given us an extra 30, 30 grand, I think. So. 
let's sell that uh, so that's 69 grand we've got um, hmm okay I'm just wondering whether or not um, we we could have um, maybe we maybe we could upgrade our hull and uh, get some more long lines perhaps uh, and maybe put um, six out instead uh, let's see dock uh, upgrades storage uh, we could go to that and upgrade to that I'm not sure whether that adds to it okay and uh, then we will go back here see we've got the autopilot but and it says that it's installed but it just uh, it's just not it's not working um, uh, what else are we looking for what we're looking for now is a uh, fish market uh, fishing gear buy deep lines let's buy another two of those buy uh, you currently have two out of a maximum of eight deep lines which can fit on yep that's okay and what we'll do is I don't think we'll bait them I think what we'll do is we'll go back out and get uh, and get the rest of our stuff um, and um, we'll bait those extra two up um, yes we do We'll bait those extra two up when we um, uh, when we come back in with a, a full haul of lines. So we'll go and pick our lines up now. See what happens. Yep. Sold that. That was crazy. We were actually going to get less for the uh, 2,000 kilos of tuna than we did for the uh, for the 400 kilos of um, of swordfish there. So interesting. Very, very interesting. All right, let's have a look at what we've got here. Uh, let's see. Let's go out here. So what I'm going to do, guys, is I'm going to end this episode here. And uh, in the next episode, I will see you when we uh, when we come out here and we pick this stuff up. Um, we'll pick this. We'll pick these lines up and um, and uh, see how we go in regards to. Um, what sort of uh, price we get. Hopefully we'll get a bit more swordfish because swordfish has been seen in this area a day ago, so um, that should be okay. But uh, if you like this one, hit like. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, please subscribe. Don't forget to come and join us on Twitch. Uh, we do have an absolute ball over there. And I will see you guys in the next episode. Thanks for watching. Bye.